If today I were to write as Nkosana and Lamini Zuma wrote in the year 213, if today I were to write a letter to our founding fathers who died several years ago, this is how the letter would read. I would not name all of them, but I would name the following. I would say, Dear Kwame Nukurum, Dear Kambarage Nyerere, Dear Patrice Emery Lumumba, Dear Modibo Keita, Dear Ahmed Sekoture, Dear Thomas Sankara, Dear Nelson Holisa Samandela, we are gathered here today in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, on this 25th day of May, 2019. And we are pretending to be discussing a new subject, but we are not. <laughs> in fact, my dear fathers, we are discussing something that you discussed 56 years ago. And we are now recognizing that you warned us that if we did not unite, we will be conquered again. I am sadly reporting to you that we are being conquered again. <laughs> we are being conquered again in the manner that you feared. And I'm now telling you that this time round, our conquest is a little more subtle. I am telling you, Osagia, for that now, Although in 1961 you had created the University of Ghana at Legon and you had also created the University of Science and Technology, in many African universities we are now accommodating Confucius Institute. <laughs> Osagiefo, we do not know what they are going to teach there in a hundred years' time. But for the moment they tell us is aid and that they like us. But Osagiefo, I agree with you, there is no free lunch. We are also sitting here today in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, the home of your brother, Julius Kambarage Nyerere. And we also are reminding ourselves that Nyerere came up with a philosophy called Ujama, which was self-reliance. We can now tell you that in substance, Mwalimu was right. But unfortunately, we are still importing things from Europe. We now have mobile phones, which you did not have when you were alive. But unfortunately, Mwalimu, those mobile phones, none of them is made in Africa. Last week, we saw an attempt by somebody to claim that one was made in Rwanda, but I suspect it was only assembled in Rwanda. Mwalimu, we are trying. I can now also confirm to you that we have many political parties, just as you fear, Dosagiev. In Congo, there are 233. But Congo is not at peace. In Tanzania, they don't have very many, but I can assure you, CCM is still doing very well. <laughs> but Tanzania is the exception rather than the rule. After every election, Mwalimu, we fight. In Kenya, we did. Then we shake hands. Then we fight. Then we shake them again. <laughs> we are in the business of shaking hands. In Central Africa, we are fighting our young men and women are drowning in the Mediterranean Sea. We now know you are right. And therefore, going forward, we are today taking a solemn vow that each one of us will use the resources at our disposal and that we are going as a product of this conference to send a paper which will emanate out of Julius Kambarage Festival, which paper will be sent to the African Union. And that paper will tell the African Union that there is a sense of urgency. And it will not stop there. That paper will also be sent to all the 55 African heads of state, reminding them that there is need for Africa to trade with ourselves, that there is need for Africa to, Africans to travel on one visa, that there is need for Africans to have one currency, that there is need for Africans to define ourselves. And Osagiefo, I remind you, I remember during your lifetime, you hosted both Malcolm X and Martin Luther King Jr. And I am reminded that at one time he was asking his people in the United States of America how long it would take to unite Africa. We are now telling you that it's not too long. It is not going to be long because young men and women are now telling us that we unite or we perish. Osagiefo, Mwalimu, Seko, I would have written a longer letter, but I can now see that my audience wants to go for lunch. Permit me, therefore, to stop here in the knowledge that Pan-Africanism is alive and well, and Africa will realize our potential even if it takes 100 years. 
God bless you. Thank you.